guys, welcome back to my video. It is Bella me see up in his house. Sorry. Hey guys, what's good? It's Bella me see here, and today I'm gonna show you how to do the perfect bantu knot on your hair. So if you guys wanna see what I did, just keep on watching. And time I did it it didn't really resonate with you so basically you take a medium section of hair and begin to thoroughly detangle that section you spritz that section with water this is optional of course because you could do it on damp or like dry hair add your moisturizer of choice be sure to smooth out your hair with either a brush or a comb I'm using my spornet brush so just start off with twisting your hair up from the root once you get about halfway through your twist, begin wrapping your hair in a circular motion around itself at the base of your twist. But just be careful not to wrap it too tight. See, I even struggle with this. I feel like when I do it in other people's hair, like, it's so much easier. But with my hair, it just takes some more patience. I think where I went wrong was I started to do the bantu knot way too tight. So I had to kind of loosen it and then wrap it around some more. So... Don't be alarmed if this happens to you. It just means that when you begin your next bantu knot, you want to make sure you start off looser at the root. So just continue to add a little bit more product at the end. Make sure it's fully detangled. Bruh. I don't know why I'm using this big comb to like comb out the ends of my hair. Like I definitely could have used a tail comb, but Bruh. just continue to twist the hair around the last ravel that you did and completely wrap it around the base of the knot until there's no more hair left to wrap. Mm -hmm. 